Listen, I think I lost one to five three years ago. It's been a while. Listen, uh, it was hard. You know, Pula was a great fighter. Very difficult, very hard. But I had to, to train hard, fit. You know, uh, you know, it's just, it's, it's, I'm happy today. At the same time, I'm sad. You know, uh, I don't have many left to me. But what I have, I'm going to give you all to you guys. I don't have many left. So my next couple of fights, it's, it's, I'm on my way out. So I don't want no easy fights. I want no hard fights. I told Eddie the other day, if you can get me the uh, which one, the Browns bomber, I'll be happy. You know, I want to fight everybody in my era. We don't lose, I just want to fight. You know, uh, thank you very much to Eddie, Metro. You know, my kids are here today. First time they see me fight. Uh, you know, I, I needed a win. You know, I've lost so many fights on the road. I needed a win, and what a great way to win it. You know, old 2 Arena. Uh, you know, I'm buzzing right now. You don't understand. And it feels great to be a winner. You don't understand. And I want to thank you guys. Thank you very much, man. But they always come out for you. Um, you have to dig deep. We spoke during the week, and I said, look, can you go to the well again? Can you go to that reserve again? You went to the well again. Oh yeah, you know when you train for these fights, bro, you have to, you have to go, you have to go to deep end, bro. You can't train half in, half out. You have to physically, mentally, body parish, die in that ring, you know, while you're training. You know, your numbers have to be amazing. You can't cheat in this game and come back in here and try and do 12 rounds. It's a lie. You know when you heard the first score, 116, 112, when you think of sort of going back years, Hellenius, Liam White, the first fight with Joseph Parker, what's going through your mind when it's 116, 112? Who then? First time round. Mate, I'm, I'm used to it, bro. If they gave it to him, I'd just jump on the train again and carry on. You know, I'm used to getting robbed. You know, so it's not, it won't be new to me. I won't be upset. I'll just move on. You know, God, you know, God, 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 God's got a plan for me. I don't know why he's here, but I'll find out soon. No robbery tonight. I, I see Don Charles with you in your corner. Yeah. It was nice to see you and Don and the team back together. Good to see the back back. Yeah, man, I went home. You know, I had to go back home, you know. Give a shout out to Don, you know, uh, he knows my style very well, you know, we cover the uppercut very well, we, fuck, we cover every, every angle, you know, because me and Don, when we work out, it's not pads, it's just physically, and uh, he's always telling me, cover this and this and this, and when I went back, he told me, I need you to cover this and this, and we'll win the fight. What does it mean to have your family here watching you, as you mentioned, for the first time as well? Let me tell you something, man. can you imagine if I lost in front of my kids? I'll tell them turn the TV off. They'll be like, hey, mommy, we should we turn the TV off because this guy tell us to turn the TV off. But you know, I'm happy I won in front of my kids. Angelina and Aurora, so I'm, I'm, I'm proud. Thank you. Eddie, come in, Eddie. The show keeps on going. He said there's only a couple more left. He wants, you heard it there, the bronze bomber. He wants big fights. What do we deliver? It was, a, it was a tough, brutal fight, grueling, sloppy at times. We knew it would be like that. Brulev likes to hold him around the back of the head. But Chisora. He deserved one tonight. You know, it was a very, very close fight. And when they read out the split, I thought, please, please, no. Because I was going to run from the ring because he kept looking for me. And he deserves it tonight. He really, for everything that he's put in, for everything he's given to the sport, he's had so many close decisions that haven't gone his way. Tonight, one did go his way. And by the way, he just beat a world top 15 fighter, probably top 10 heavyweight. Now, you talk about what Derek Chisora's got left. Don't take away what he's just achieved in the ring, which is being a top 15, top 10 heavyweight. So we'll see what the future holds. I was just desperate to see him win tonight. He's got such a big heart. You see that. He never, ever quits. And uh, like I said, just beating a top 15, top 10 in the world heavyweight. So why not roll on bigger fights? Derek, Derek, don't go. Final word from yourself, Derek. Derek. Derek, final word from you. Again, you're putting some big performances at the O2 Arena, Manchester Arena. Is this your home next now for the next couple of fights, the O2? Yeah, you know, I, you know, I want to be honest, you know, Eddie, you're here, come on, Eddie, I'm going to have a go at you now. Come on, Eddie. Yeah. You know, Eddie, you're paying, where, where, where's Connor, where's my little brother? He's gone, he's Connor gone. Oh. He's gone. You're paying Connor so much money, you're paying AJ so much money. Can I get some money now? No, right. Because if you don't give me money, I'm going to the other side. <laughs> yeah. So pay me some money now. I'm just happy to see you with you. Can all right. Right. I'm doing right. Kids in private school, bro. I need to get paid now. We always look after you. Yeah, I know you look, he looks up to me, but not the way I want to be looked after, do you understand? I want to have some cubby. I'm tired of having fish and chips now. Caviar is coming. Eddie, give me some caviar because we have the answer. So, Derek Shaw, fantastic. Derek, fantastic.
Fantastic performance as always. Well done. Congratulations.